Hello. Welcome back to the channel, I guess. So be back and we be doing something today. Let's see where we are right now. Uh I don't know what we had in the last stream, but I've uh, done all the detail that I can on the body. I mean, everywhere. Basically, I used some of these alphas and the manual work. And this is interesting. Why do I have that over there? Yeah, so some manual work here and there, and obviously, I did the face as well which was not there before this is what i had before thank god i have a duplicate of it but this is what i had before and uh, this is what we got now i really like the horns that i did here they turned out pretty nice i'm pretty happy with what i have here for the detail yeah these are pretty cool then I did some manual work on all of these areas to just like you know have different variation for the scale and basically what I want to do today uh, is create more variation as like as you can see here this is just like same alpha maybe so if I just like create some manual variation here and there that would make it look more interesting I guess let's see so I just want to do that and on the body I did something as well Let's see what I did so as I was talking in the last stream I thought it will be interesting to have some of the scale coming here the shoulder which I did it turned out okay I don't remember doing these but they look interesting accident and I feel like maybe I can have few more here so it would just blend be better like the way you see it here and uh, here what's happening is this is very symmetrical so I want to break the detail here all of this maybe remove few and have them look not that perfect on both the sides or make them look different oh i forgot to turn on the symmetry so i have some different here and this is not there which i'll do manually let's try a little bit of variation again and after using alpha on the nose I did go in and like create a lot of variation like as you can see there's a different height or just inflated out few of this stuff maybe but doesn't look that great so maybe I need a little more of that here on the nose So oh, this is very heavy, heavy. it's 53 mil for the whole thing, it's all of this, alright so let's start with the face I guess, and let's do this, before I do that just give me a second to figure this out maybe I need music then let me copy this and put it there Who else would I send this to? I should be good. Hmm. 
Let me see if I can find some music. Play my music here. Oh. Okay, I hope this is not too loud. Let me know if it is. We'll fix that. Uh, should be able to hear me over the music, and that should be good enough. Uh, I've been talking too much today, so let me put myself on mute and uh, dig on this one. This might look very boring to begin with because it's just like that you just do this same thing again and again. It was calling me right now. True. Okay, I go. So some of these areas, as you can see, I've already done this. Just adding just a tiny bit of variation over there. It just like looks way better. This is my highest subdue which is 16 mil. Should be good enough for the head. Oh, don't like that. I'll do this one. Oh, need my glasses. I need to power up. There we go, much better. So I'm thinking of having some guests on the stream, so I'll try to find some few people who are willing to come on stream. I do any changes or when I do anything I just zoom out and see how, how it looks everything because it's very easy to lose yourself when you're like working very closely and uh, yeah I like this area See if I have the other side of it turn off symmetry. Should have this button over here. 
but easier to know whether I have it on or not. working on the detail it's much better like to actually work on the volumes the detail is details are boring to me hey Ajay how are you man it's been it's been long time Drop me a message if you ever come to Bangalore side, bruh. Would love to meet you again. I'm saying this just to be nice. Maybe I am. Oh. Details are boring. I should do this offline. But I just wanted everyone to know like, just putting alpha is not enough. If you have something, just break it up. Create a lot of variation in that thing. So, you know. Need to refine all of this a lot more. So I'm not gonna zoom in like this and look at anything so I don't care about all the places that I have there or the account of my topology. So my goal is to create a variation where I can see from this angle and see some difference in the nose. Let's say push this inside, bring this edge out a bit. Something like that but Ladder. Yeah. Stick this as well. Okay, I remember doing these lines. That's what I need. But maybe a little more readability over there. Yep, that's cool. That, that's the whole idea. I don't have symmetry on face, like the level or the distance is not the same on both the sides so probably have to do it manually if i try to use it it won't work oh, let's figure this out yeah, i think if i create the bigger ones these should be more than enough for now, data I can have some more if needed.
and uh, something that i don't like about this thing right now is these scales i'll probably get rid of these and maybe try to figure out something here i will get that done properly Solo. Want this to be too big here. Take this up like that. I get bored of this, I'll probably do something else because. I don't like details, they're boring. <clears throat> I think having like some of some like bit smaller pieces in there would be nice. Good, I guess. Things which I've already created before. Yeah, 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 figure it out. 
now on this is the last one where i'll do detail on detailing part because this is boring i'll rather do some sketches from now on even if they're incomplete i'll rather do sketching face volume stuff face sketches just had a point that when you're done with alpha do something extra top of it to make it look good that was the this is the whole point of this stream so if you get it then go work on your stuff pick this whole boring thing and go work on your stuff Why do I have this line here? This thing's... This music just confused me for a second. with this area I look at this this is a bit flat and this looks a bit flat I wanna crowd everything I just want some of them to be like bit less I mean it doesn't have to stick out everywhere that would create more interest I guess Should be good. Good
yeah, as you can see it's having like good variation like this helps i think Let me figure this out on the other side. Let me find a few of this here. I do this to myself. This is too soft. Need to add something over there. But this is the idea. I better do this offline. This is not too much. And maybe I wanna enhance some of these details as well. This is in layer. So, what I'll do, I'll go to the lower subdue, create some sharper lines like this. Right? So, what it does, I can have some variation like these deeper lines, but when I go to the higher subdue, I still have the detail that was existing then I can just probably sharpen it a little more what happens if I do it directly that looks a bit weird okay like it, you don't get the same depth and you pull in the mesh a lot more so I prefer doing this way then another level to sharpen it up and I feel this something like that how do you get this? Quickly, just to stand only.
yeah i really like the details on the horns that pretty turned out pretty nice hey shando how are you man thank you bro i pretty much like the detail on the horns which turned out really nice but uh, if i had to i would just do one more pass to refine everything and make it more organic or like more uneven everywhere that way so with the paint and everything looks will look much better so sometimes you have to be very loose with the detail just don't think too much just be loose with a lot of these details hope i have symmetry now Very nice, maybe I need to add some here. As you can see, I've created enough variation on the smaller scales as well. And I wanted some area to feel a bit flatter. <laughs> I don't want to want these details to stand out too much. Just like they should like stick out enough. Okay. Let's move to body for a bit and go to the lower subdue and just pull this out a bit. I'm not doing this on the highest subdue. Get rid of this. I don't want this. There we go. If I have some of these like smaller ones near the bigger one, it just blends better. Yeah. So the first pass that I'm going through right now, it's on like the lower subdue. Once I have enough height over there, what I want to do is go to the higher subdue again and like define it a little better. subdue again and I'll do one more pass on top of this as you can see I might not have enough topology but I actually don't care should be good enough for what I need subdue yep this is the oh not bad this is the highest subdue now as you can see they're not like too round or perfect i can just like break it up all oh, they're just so the idea is like you might have to go through the entire model doing this 
I mean, you don't have to, but if you do, uh, it'll help a lot. It'll look much better. This kind of everything. So if I zoom out and I say, I don't like these two. They may be like stick out, sticking out a little too much. All three of these. If I try to blend them better. And if I don't like any of this, this is in a layer. So I'll just go back and turn off the layer. And just morph it back. If I don't like it. As you can see all of these were done manually using the same thing. I just like mask out the area inflated out or pulled it out then manually work on the edges it makes sense but if i could if i was like really wanted this to look good so every alpha that i have here not each and every scale but i would randomly choose few and create variation which is like sticking out like we did on the face they'll help a lot so just let me try three of them over here this is interesting so the direction is like this way for all of the bigger ones so it would make sense if i pull this out the other way normally we were doing this in this case i want to do this and here yeah this Let's let this I accept you if you make everything stick out it would look actually it would look weird only few of them let's say this one maybe this one about this one maybe something which is closer to the bigger one as you can see i'm already running out of the polygons i'm already on the highest sub view 3 mil polygons for hands but again i don't need a lot of polygons here because i just want if i see like if i zoom out this way if I see them, that should be more than enough. More than enough for what I need. But if I actually needed like a very high poly model, I would do, I already have everything poly grouped, like the hands and feet and everything. I just separate them out and maybe like subdivide it one more time. If needed. As for this is already looking a bit interesting to me. Yeah, especially like with the color that I have, I think this works much better. You can see it actually works. this is the idea just cover the entire model this way just go through everything it is time consuming but it's worth it it's totally worth it so i'll do it off stream because it takes a lot of time and it's not worth watching it i think i got my point across so this should be enough we can call it done and i need to work on the bell i've not done anything on the bell I think rest everything is fine. These are like detail code, and uh, I've done the detail that I need. I need to work on the bell and the feet that I have here. Wait, I should also, uh, also have a tongue. I'll work on those off stream. I've done anything on this.
Uh, should be enough. Maybe I'll do one more pass. Just like you can see, like the sharper lines here and there. It's worth it. Something. Something like like that. If that makes sense, but I think for now it should be good enough. Should be good enough. So I'm gonna call it done. That's the, that was the point of the stream. Just like you know, go through the whole thing and break. So let's just call this like breaking your uh, alpha details. Just break your alpha details basically. Not everything, but like some of these to like you know make them more interesting. I think this is pretty good example. I kind of like this area. And uh, what I did here also worked pretty good. So something like this. Maybe I could make it a little more denser in these areas. Alright. Uh, there we go. Again, as you can see like this is not even clean detail it's just like single stroke and just like it's faces basically it's faces here right but if you zoom out and look at the whole picture it looks decent enough i don't want to sound like a broken record and keep saying the same thing so let's just call it done i'm gonna work on it yeah uh, yeah oh by the way is something i'm working on right now i just had that hellboy base and i think it, i kind of like the face that i had over there so i was like you know what let me do something with that i like the side view it's pretty decent i don't like this maybe i need to work on this and figure this out maybe like more rounder shape at the bottom but i i'm pretty happy with the side view that i have here this looks pretty cool so maybe I wanna do this so this was done in like maybe half an hour so i would uh, focus my stream doing like these kind of sketches instead of doing a lot of details so once i'm done with this i'm gonna start something like this and let's do something like this the next time just do sketch like this just doable in just one stream so that should be more fun and uh, join me and sketch with me and see you in the next stream peace out peace out boys peace out